Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Roxy. I'm here today with another short hair transformation where I will be adding eight inches of hair to the very front of my hair. I'm going to try and do a wispy, a wispy bang, but we'll see how it turns out. Either way, I think it'll be fine. Um, so basically right now my hair is kind of dry wrapped right so this is because yesterday I molded my hair and I styled my own pixie I did create a video on that so you can check it out over here or I'll leave the I'll leave the link below if that helps so um, before I went to bed I added some um, ORS um, to my hair so it didn't dry out and I put my head tie on and then in the morning this is basically what I'm left with so it looks like this but Today I just want to spice it up a bit, change it up, you know what I mean? I kind of feel like this channel is turning into a channel where ladies with pixie cuts or short hair can come and get some short hair inspiration, get some ideas on how they can switch it up and change it up a bit. Because sometimes short hair can just get boring to be honest. I don't want to use that word because short hair is like the best. But it can get... Um, you can get kind of comfortable with the same style and then you want to spice it up so I just want to be able to give that to you okay so that's an aspect of my channel uh, I just want to say thank you so much for 5,000 subscribers I really appreciate each and every one of you guys um, you guys make this journey so much more fun for me um, I love getting into your comments um, I love just creating new content for you guys because it's fun for me and I get to share it um, so without further ado, let's get into this video. I don't want to talk too much. Let's get into this video. If you want to see how I get things done, of course, as always, stay tuned. <laughs> the hair that I'm going to be using today is Empire um, by Sensational, I believe. It's in the length 8 inches in color number 1, which is jet black. So I'm going to be parting out my hair, um, which is where I will be laying the first track. After parting it, I measure the track against my part, add some glue, and then I will be laying down the track. After I lay down the track, I'm going to just seal it off with some mega hold spritz, which you'll see. And this is the same steps I will be doing until I get to um, the, until I cover the top of my head. down two tracks I know in the past I've read comments where um, some of you are asking me or saying that adding glue directly to my hair or my scalp is not safe and my hair is gonna be my hair is gonna ripped up gonna rip out and become damaged but there's an option where you can lay some GPS on each track let it dry and then add the glue on top of it if you prefer or you can even um, GPS and wrap the whole top and then glue the tracks on top. Um, for me personally, I don't have a problem with breakage or the glue damaging my hair. And also to try and prevent that, I do not um, put the first track so close to my hairline. I kind of give it about an inch before putting in the first track. So save the comments, please. I understand the dangers of glue. 
um, it's just my personal preference not um, like to directly put the glue on my on my hair or my scalp and it works out just fine for me all right so let's go Link tracks. Okay, so it's not too thick. Um, it's the weight that I like it, I would say. I did use less than half a pack. Alright, so it looks like this. I laid the tracks down. We're gonna go ahead and cut. Okay? it the what I did was I took some off the sides here so that I can see my ear so I shaped around my ear and I layered some at the side here and then I kind of layered some at the top here after I style it I might go back in and kind of razor it down a bit or cut it but for now this is okay so I'm just gonna take some holding spray and lightly lightly spray my hair turned off so basically um, what I first started doing was curling it and I found that it was too tight 
So I tried to pin curl it and then pulled it out and then I kind of just smoothed it out a bit. So it's giving me a, a wispier bang and I like it like this. So I'm gonna try and keep up the wispy bang look. So just keep, keep watching, keep watching. <laughs> comb now and I want to say to kind of shape it and layer it a little bit more right so I'm gonna go to the top and then just do this
so this is pretty much like the finished look right so as you can see this was very easy very quick very quick to do it gave me some more I don't know some more style some more pizzazz you know it's summertime there's probably a barbecue coming up tomorrow that might just pop up out of nowhere but anyway that's just me crossing my fingers so yeah and one thing I like about this as well it's very flexible so if you're good with your hands you can kind of create different styles so for example you can do like a little might be too wild for y'all but might you can do like a little you can move it to the other side no okay no maybe a mohawk you can do like a mohawk style where it's more to the middle You can kind of zhuzh it up at the top and um, like making it higher, making it look more voluminous by adding some stiff spray, of course, and then kind of teasing it and pulling it if you want it to be more poofy. But what I'll be doing is kind of carrying it forward and wisping it out. So just carry it forward, wisp it out, carry it forward, wisp it out. And this is what I love about short hair transformations. It's so easy to do. You can take it out the next day if you just really miss your hair. Well, that's just me. I usually do, do my hair and then the next day I take it out or I can't keep it in for too long because I just miss having my own hair styled on my head. All right. So this is her. I can't stop touching it. So this is her. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> ah, okay I really hope you guys enjoyed this video um, I'm so tired guys I'm pregnant I'm pregnant guys still pregnant I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video um, don't forget to subscribe before you leave subscribe thank you because I got more for you um, don't forget to like give me a thumbs up if you like my short hair tutorials just give me a thumbs up please thank you um also comment i'll try to get um to your questions if you have any questions if you just want to say hey just say hey that's fine and of course as usual i'll see you in my next video bye